And I'm telling you, people, the anime watchers, I'm going to bring them. And they're going to be like, yeah. At, they're going to at you the whole time on Instagram. Like, yes, you yeah. should watch it. You should watch oh, it. Oh, anime, that shit weird as hell. Cause I, it be, I, I had it, one anime nigga in my club, bro. His ass used to show my words. I used to stay fighting. Know, like, I used you know, to fight his ass like two times every, like every week. His ass, cause he just used to stay doing weird. It's just like he always did be doing a little weird ass shit. This shit be like, that. He like, and then he be like, that. I don't even want to talk about this shit. But that anime shit here, then nigga be thinking that they somewhere they ain't not got their like, arm behind their back running this shit. True. Everybody um, talking about that shit twice. You run with them, I better. God, did he get drunk? Yeah, they say we can't talk to the dead, cause the dick ride him off. Yo, what's up? You already know, we with Flophouse Atlanta. It's your girl, Cy, aka Cy the Succubus, and I'm here with... Baby Kia. So, this is your first interview, how you feeling? Good. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good? You a little nervous? Yeah, no. Nah. I don't know, I'm a little excited, a little nervous, so I need you to do something for me. It depends. Okay. Teach me how to do an ad lib. Pitch, pitch your favorite ad lib and like teach me how to do it real quick. My favorite. I don't got ad lib. You don't have no ad libs? I don't do ad libs. No attitude, no favorite word, nothing. Nope. I got a I got a plant word, like a space word. What's your space word? Right. It'd be it just depends like how the song get, yeah. how my vibe come on. Like Okay, how you doing now? Like, What's if your I'm, space word now? If um it just depends how to be like, say it just depends what we rapping on. If it's a drill shit and, and one of my bars short, and then I gotta come, I gotta have a little pause. I don't like spaces in between. I don't like empty spaces on my beats, cause that shit just make my work it to feel lazy. Do so that. I say some shit like, like yeah. I probably say shit like, come here, or, or. I want you to come here, come here. Or you just gotta, you just, you just gotta put aggression in your voice. You gotta come here. like that. Hell no. <laughs> you gotta say it like. Like I mean, come here, like, like, come here, not like, come here, like, come here, come here, but with aggression, like, uh, like somebody over there, and they got something you want, and they ain't coming, nigga. Right. Come here, like, come here. Nah, hell, no. <laughs> no, I'm, a, I'm gonna get it one day, it's one day. Today. But I mean, it's a good warm up, you know. Nah, that one. People can try to practice it. I don't think they're gonna get as good as you, but I mean, okay, so. Scope the internet. You don't really got much about you, so I know that this is your first interview, so we really got to get into who you are, let these people know. So where do you come from? Come from Atlanta, Georgia. I was born. I was born in eighth grade. I was 17. I grew up at, when I was around, I'd say from like, to around when I was like nine years old, I stayed on Cundin. I went to Cool Elementary, then I went to John Hope. And I moved, I moved out there in Lakewood. From Lakewood, I started going to Price Middle School. From from Lakewood, I moved to the West End. Then I was still attending Price, got kicked out of Price. I went back to Wesley, where I got kicked out of when I was a little ass kid. Yeah. I was like nine or eight okay, when I got, got kicked out. Fools. Bro, like, like it would probably be it probably be some little bad like some little stupid ass shit. Why like, you tell me sit down? I ain't a lot to, I used to take medicine as a kid cause I got ADHD. I got ODD. Um, okay, that's how you knew I ODD I got I got opposition to fight disorder. So it's like I feel it. I know that shit real because if you tell me do something and it might be right. Like even though that shit might be right and I don't wanna do it, like that shit gonna really make me mad. So I'm a Four round dudes is a dumb ass shit. It just like little shit like that. I might four around throw. I remember the, the first time I think I got kicked out of school. I did something to a real boy. I just know I did some violent ass shit. And I ain't wanna talk about this shit. But I know I did something. I got kicked out of there. From there. When I went when I, from there I went from Wesley. I went and got down Carver. Then I got kicked out of Carver. Jesus. I got kicked out of Carver. I went to South Atlanta from when I when I when I got when I went to South Carolina, I was leaving on Cleveland. I moved to Cleveland by that time, so I moved to Cleveland. I was around like ten. Oh, no, I say I moved to Cleveland. I was like eleven, twelve. I got for that shit. I was around eleven, twelve. Cause my mom, my mom bought, my mom bought a house on Cleveland. 
Alright, fuck that shit. I'm on my house on Cleveland. And she was happy about that shit, because it was her first house. So shit, I'm over to Cleveland. That's my last stop. Like, this is a real house, because I was in house, I'm in apartment, had no townhouses and shit. So when she got her first house, she happy, so I know that my last stop. That's why I settled down at. Then when that word got down, she started opening up from. Like, that's where I met these niggas. Okay, like, what you meet them? I ain't gonna lie, I met, I met them in, in elsewhere, but like, not knowing that they was already in my atmosphere, like, they already around me, but I wasn't just like coming outside, all, all in the areas where they were. Like, I, I was playing basketball around like 14, 13 and shit. I was, I was still fucking with basketball. I was still trying to go down, go to the NBA. I was still thinking I'd go to the NBA. Yeah, I'm still going to the basketball court outside, practicing and shit. 15, no, when I was 14, my mom passed. That was shit start, like, right again. Hey, baby kid, that when that shit start. Is that when you started rapping? Nah, hell no. Nah. It just when I started rapping when I met him. Mm -hmm. I started rapping when I met with him. How I started rapping was on accident, and it was not on purpose at all. I I really got real rapping shit was to me that shit down that felt like force. He like man, twin, get on the beat. I'm like man, here and nah, so I can't do this. I can't do it. I'm like, bro, Jay, get on the twin. And he aggressive like I can't even tell you. I can't even re re react it like how it was in the studio, but like. He he didn't make it get in it, but yeah, get in it, get in it, bit. Yeah, say something. Yeah, I better say something. He said you got something to say. Yeah, yeah. And, and you don't got number five bars. You the first thing number down there like five six bars. So you gotta say some quick shit. And I got that bit. Say that. Shit, we got. I started liking it. Like, okay. Yeah, okay. Right. But, like, it wasn't no shit I was still, like, thinking about rapping. Like, I ain't like, man, hey, I'm finna go crazy with this rap shit. I'm finna be a rapper. Like, this around the time he rapping, and he was rapping. Around the time when I started rapping, he got, he was in fear, like, but he was going crazy. Both of them were going crazy with the rap shit. Like, I was just with him. Like, I'm in the studio every day. I was doing other shit. Mm -hmm. But, I mean, I'm with each other. Like, we with each other. But rapping was my main priority. Like, that wasn't no focus for me. And my first song was on the phone. God. I mean, my first song on the phone, my little brother, then I went to I went, went his studio session. We made it, and I shot the video. Yeah. She was like, that shit. Okay. Where'd you get your name from, though? Ha. Uh, How? Like, what does that mean? What does that mean to you? Everyone has a name for a reason. Yeah. My name, Baby Kid, right? Like, okay. So, so what you think of me? You're a baby. And your real name's Kia. Like, I don't know. Or you like Kias. I don't know. I'm not hip. That's what I'm asking. Yeah. You're a baby. Yeah, nah. But hey, yeah. You're a little young, so. Yeah, I'm um, baby. Nah, the baby part is where you got it right. And name shit, you just love me. Right? I don't know. But it came from the cars. Like, I was doing that shit. I was. Cars. So, didn't know. I like cars, and I like to drive, too. Okay. Right. I like. Didn't know, but my like, name, right. baby kid, just it's from the car, kid. Didn't know, yeah. If you know, you know, like this. You know, yeah. You know. If you know, you know. But it comes for cars and it comes for driving, and I and I know how to drive real good, and I be playing around with them most. Like I might fall around, spinning beat around, then like it just. How long you been driving for? No, like, hold on. You're so you're young. Ain't gonna lie, I was like. 15, when I really learned how to drive. I mean, that's a good age, yeah. I stole the car. My first, my first time, I, my first time stealing the car, I was like 15. And from there, it, just, it was just that. It easy from there. Damn, once you, you, like you learn how to drive, like, it's it good. Like, it, you take off. Damn. So, that's what I did. You was playing GTA in real life. That's crazy. Something like that. Something like that. <laughs> Something like that. But you're not trying to harm people. It's all about money. Like, it's just a word. It, your word ethic might be some positive shit. My word ethic was bad. I'm, we waking up at 6 o'clock in the morning. We finna go. And we, yeah, we finna go take shit. We finna go take some. Like, we trying to make some money. Like, this is all. It was really all about. You know what I mean? Like, at first, it was fun too, though. I ain't gonna lie, we were doing some badass shit with them cars. But it was fun. At first, I was having fun with the shit. That's why I got the baby kid in that front. Going crazy, stealing all them kids. Having fun. 
Like that's just what it was. Mm-hmm. And then I got every kid cause I was doing it by myself at first. And I was doing it with some of my partner. Okay. I got one partner, Lil Snit. Yeah. And I gave him the name Ebert. Because how he pulled the car, like how he pulled the emergency brake up. He might he might be doing like eighty. Come down a little shit back street. He'll pull the emergency brake on 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 the turn to turn it bit. It might fall around spin. He might get it right, get it bit right. All right. Like damn, he's he's that's who was doing it with me. Like I, I'm doing it. I know how to do it. And he just driving with me. Like all right, hunt on here you go. Wow. Now I'm finna go get mine. Now we finna go crazy. Like that's me. And, it was me and Ebert. It was me and Slick. That we got our name from. Like and I we was young niggas doing it. Oh, so like baby kid. And then it like, and I also, when I first came over the name in the car, the fuck, it's just like every time I took a fucking kid, it was a fucking car seat in that bitch. Like, it always was just baby shit in there. <laughs> that was so funny. Like, That's and then it was like, funny. young nigga, yeah. I was listening to my song, one of my songs I had made. It bit with that hit. Baby kid. Boy, let's slip. This was crazy shit. <laughs> Boom. E break. All right, baby killer, you break. But he was he rap too. He just ain't go like with that name. Mm-hmm. But that was just a name like that, man. He don't care. Okay. Okay, so speaking about music, what is your biz- biggest inspiration musically? Now? In general, now? In myself. Just but you? Inspiration music. I want to really say... I got an inspiration, a, a, a really like personal inspiration on music, right? Bass, because like just for the simple fact that I never wanted to be a rapper like my whole life. This shit that came about like a year ago, like a, a couple months ago. I like really just started taking it really, really serious like a month ago. So I wouldn't really say I got no inspiration, but I got artists that I came up listening to a lot, like yeah, like Young Boy, Boosie, right now. A little bit of that, you know, X, because you oh, weird to hear. Stop. So yeah, of course him. I know X. Yeah, then I grew X. up following him. I, I listened a little bit to him. That era. You know, DMX. Okay. I listened to DMX, mystical with my dad. You see, we ride with my pop in the mm. car. Like, little shit like that. And got to like, what? Yeah, but I can't really pinpoint it, because I really, like, if I, it's, it's a rap that I like, that's just the main shit what I listen to. Like, as a young nigga, I'm I'm keep real. I just listen to Young Boy, Goddamn Rollo, Rodriguez. It ain't really about it. I ain't really listen to a lot of people, but yeah, just like, that I can remember. Well, I could say like idol wise, but then so. Well, since your biggest inspiration is yourself, how did you cultivate your sound? Because it's very my, distinct. My biggest yeah. inspiration is really my bro. I ain't gonna lie, my pop. Keep it real, okay. Like they was doing this shit before me. All my part, like, think I, all my songs is based off energy in the studio. Like, and you can hear it in mic. The songs which I like the most, like they let's play a little game. Like I'm, I'm calling they at back to back. I don't know how many, how many times I called you with it. by making that song. It took me two days to record it, but I recorded the hook the first day. To like four, like three hours, I recorded this song. Like it be got to be right there that one. Call this nigga like four times every and this and I only got like three. I probably had like three bars the same three bars. He like, bro, you still calling me with this shit, bro? Yes, yeah, say it. I probably say that shit the right, and then I take it off. Be like, nah, that ain't it. Well, that'd be the right one. I fuck around, say it, it be it. Then that day, I just finished that bit. Like, I just say my bro, cause most of my most of my song is made around them. Like on the in the studio. I'm going to the studio by myself. I ain't never really been to the studio by myself. I ain't like, with them. That's crazy. Because you can tell. Most of my songs, wait, no, I don't even got that many solo songs. If you if you count the songs that I'm featured on and the ratio of songs that I'm just on by myself, yeah, I, it'd be out on by featured songs. Because, wow. like, most of, like, some of my favorite songs are with them. Especially then, making, this, like, making songs at home, like, Bounce back and forth. Mm. Like, we just in that bit. Like we're going to listen to the beat probably about 30 minutes to an hour. But I bet you the get bit come out, the motherfucker going to do four, five 500,000 views. Y'all going to sit right here and listen to this trailer all day back to back because you ain't got this song. 
Okay, but like, what is the energy that causes the violence? Because you you be saying some devious shit. What the hell you mean? The shit that you see. The shit that goes around you. Okay. Around, uh, around you. Like, the shit that evolves around you. Yeah, but like, it's like, there's an energy here that I don't see like right now. It's like, y'all are very well managed. Because we in a different, so we in a different setting. Video, it's like, where does that come from? Bro, like, cause we in a different setting. We did shit by ourselves. Like most of everything that we, everything that we did, all the ability that we accumulated over these times, like so far as rapping and, and just, like I mean, we know how to record all like, oh, this shit. It was going on around away from our parents, so we doing what the fuck we want to do. We talking how the fuck we want to talk. Whatever we want to do, we like, gonna do it. Manner. I bet you not anything that we done did what equal what got us to where the fuck we at right now. None of our parents will approve that shit. So I just say fair. Yeah, like this. Fair. <laughs> I say, what what the fuck the word is? It's just it's just the freedom. Y'all just that's what it is. Shit. We we buy whatever we yeah, want to do, we could do it. The craziest shit possible. Like it ain't like, boom, can we do it? No, no we no, thinking about some shit. What we could do, what we would do, and we 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 don't have parents. We go, bro. Damn, I wish I was grown. I wish I wish my mom there. Why were right here with me? I wish I had my own shit. Do what I want to do. We 14, 15 doing this shit now. We can do it, cause we outside. We can do it for we still in the car. Okay, cool. We got our own car now. That's how we feel. We got we got us somebody to get us Airbnb. Oh, we got us. We lit. We got us. How the how you did? So we do it. That shit, the shit that all goes on around you. Hey, what is go goes on in your music? Mm-hmm. That's how I feel. Like that's where I get my music from. Everything was going around me. He gonna get hurt in my son. Like everything. I mean, I don't know, man. Cause you be talking about ripping people's head off, drinking their blood, doing the violence. It's like that's crazy. Like, where did you get that deviousness? Like, even Drewski had something to say about it. You seen that video? Where Drewski like literally like type like stole your flow is like screaming on the mic, talk about like doing the most craziest shit to people, like you were yeah. talking about. So it's like <laughs> it's just crazy and very different. It was like you talking about war crimes at this point. It did. I ain't got a lot of movies and shit too. A lot of movies and I and like what movies. What kind of movies? I I crazy movie. You, you like know what the visit is? Mm-hmm. No the hell you don't. How did you feel when you saw yourself blowing up on TikTok? I ain't even see it. I didn't. At all? At all? Nope. So I only got TikTok on my phone. So how'd the song get on TikTok? Leaky shit. Early page. Full early page. Oh, how y'all nigga? I can't tell them, because I already know you got beef with these niggas. Nah, I ain't got beef with no nigga. I, I'm, I'm a rapper. Like, I'm not a, I'm not a, uh, I'm not a bad person. No, but it's like, why would you leak my stuff? Like, oh, you work hard for it. So. I don't even know what the fuck. Beef, I thought beef was a fucking fool. I ain't got beef with nobody. Because you gonna eat these niggas up, period. Nah, what the fuck is he talking about? All right, talking about food. <laughs> Food, yeah. No real beef, just is disrespectful to be reposting and unreleased songs, but Yeah. yeah. But it is what it is. But without no soft fat nigga, I really wouldn't be where the fuck I'd be at today though, if you really think about it, cause I ain't drop shit. I never really did shit with my music. This nigga and this nigga tend to drive every day to make it leave, make up you learn the master, what the fuck you do? Every day wake up, we be we'll probably sit on the phone probably thirty minutes probably, probably talking about shit. Bruh, you still ain't twin. Do this, this is cover right here. I, I could go on my phone. If I log in my old, 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 old iCloud, I can show you probably like seven, eight covers that I didn't use, that I put a Ben used, I put a Ben job. I got so much, like, I put a Ben job, all that shit. I just never gave a fuck about it. Because rapping wasn't on my mind. It was all day, I was rapping, I was going crazy with that shit. I can't do that shit. Looking at you like that. Especially the dick dumb man, he is, man. He ain't been rapping as a little kid, huh? Uh, what the hell you think? I'm finna come in and see the go. But then, every day, it just, based on my work, it's, I just seen, like, being in the studio with these niggas every day, that shit easy. That shit possible. You won't even believe I never, I ain't wrote shit since. Since what? I wrote some of this shit. What I wrote since I wrote, I wrote BK back. Yep. I wrote BK back. They, this last song I could remember writing. I don't remember writing shit. I probably write like the first three bars of the song and then I'll take on, take out. 
Mm. Yeah, all right, shit. So you're more of like the performer rather than the writer. And I'm shaming that shit. A lot of it don't be right, right, right. 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 shit, you know. Like, it's more so go in the studio, play that bit. Oh, we doing? And just go. Man, these niggas looking at each other all day like this. About 25 minutes, like I said, and we gone. Get in that bit, we gone. That's gonna be hard, so I might as well. But what's the real name of the song? Let's play a little game. It wasn't no real name to that bit. It was just tired of kill. I was in, I was in the house that doing shit. I was in my partner house. My partner registered. Then they got a little music computer and shit. So I walked up and that guy down. I ain't, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't wanna go home. This is funny shit. They like what really happened. Or the real reason why I made this song by myself, why I learned how to engineer the same day I made this song. And I had stolen that one that dude truck. That's all. <laughs> Cause I had a video shoot with my partner crazy. Yeah, damn. Like, hey, then my lift shit was tripping. I had all these money on live. I mean, on cash. That motherfucker went. I'm like, man, fuck that. Keys in there. Park sleep. He ain't going to know. I'm going to be right back. Then I had drank a wind, got my little part, little D went there. I know it's just that I woke up, regular shit. But I had a been this shit like that before. I ain't gonna lie, but that's what that shit ain't. He probably why that motherfucker I ain't gonna tell him about all the time. Like, yeah, but long story short. I was at my partner house for a couple for a couple of days. Like I went to the house, grabbed clothes, she from like, yeah. yeah, I made a song by myself. I just not not tired of that big kid. Like I didn't think I was gonna do nothing with that motherfucker. I let it be on the computer. Like for that little I got that motherfucker. I never even made no trailer to it. Mm-hmm. I made a trailer to this song like a month later on some board shit, and I never even posted it. So that song was just like on some homeboy like- shit. Wow. I was just sitting in the house, bored of here. And nigga Jimmy, he had a partner named Jimmy, he pulled up to that bitch, sent me that bitch. Straight out of that bitch, like, yeah, water bitch. Right? Mm-hmm. I just knew it was the one, because Jimmy, Jimmy makes a pie beat. Jimmy, like, if you tell him what you want, he shit just different. Like, he know how to, like, you know how people are probably use the same sample beat? Mm-hmm. Like, a lot. He'll probably take. He probably don't do this shit like he'll switch it up. He'll probably he'll probably hit the same self beat, but you won't even realize it because of how much he done meet that bit so much. Oh. And then it should be different. So it like your shit won't sound like everybody else. And I got my own flow, but I need my own beat. Yeah, for sure. Very original. It really won't even be hard to find the type of beat what I really like. We pick it for that beat shit. But I think I need beat beat as you yeah. Oh. I'm just keep it real with the way I be talking about. They be still me, I be shit. They really be asking for it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it be fine. hard to find a beat. Okay, so as you said, you wrote, the last thing you wrote was um, BK Bad. So, how was that and where did you come back from? Ha ha ha. Did I mean people want to know? Like, they're like, where you came back from? I came back from the dead. I mean, that's true. Yep, everybody know that place. And um, I was there a couple of days. Yeah, yeah, bad place. It's a place by force. Yeah, yeah, for 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 little, little bad ass kid, wanna do little bad ass shit. Yeah, where's your bad? A place where you get here, somewhere located in Atlanta, Georgia. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yep. Okay. And and when I was released from that place, I was released on the turn. Oh, uh, well, you see that motherfucker gone. Mm-hmm. Yep. So I was just in the house thinking. I really accumulated the song while I was in the set thinking, but I forgot about it a bit. And I got there, I get on band, I can't go nowhere. Man, I don't get on my way, get on band, I be clowning for for being in band, but that shit that I come in handy sometimes, cause I done made a lot of fire songs on band, where nobody know that I don't record in the studio. That y'all never heard on band, like at least one or two of those songs. Wait, well, a lot of folk like came from in the but hey, yeah, in the house. That song, just thoughts. I'm on the phone with him. Mm-hmm. Like, this is the phone call. I call him back to back. Screen recording, both for like, look, so he do what I got right here. And I hear I'm like, it ain't it. I ain't never put it out. I waited. 
I got all that time, it was over with. And I just let the bed out of the cell, scrape me in that motherfucker in the studio, it was off for now. I never even dropped that bit, cause I, I ain't really like it. You don't even believe that I kept him in there. I like that shit, ah. Then, then his ass put that bit at the end of his picture. The motherfucker went, oh, eight shit. I like, what the fuck? Man, everybody thought it was him. Like, so many people, I'm like, but I didn't know that. This nigga telling me, like, you know, everybody don't think that's you. They think that. It's damn shit. Oh, How'd you make the air? How'd you make it known that it was? I never did because I really, like I said, I ain't give a fuck. This was the right time. I wasn't taking this shit serious. I, went, I was just going to the studio and make shit where they had featured and shit. Cause he, he like, trying to fire your ass better. All right. Yeah. What the heck? Okay. Things happen for the reason. So, you know, since you a little bit of a drill rapper per se, got a little bit of beefs. So, people been talking about Lil Ray. How do you feel about the mocking and silly ha ha? Uh oh. Somebody was saying they they sampled a video. It was. Shit, who? What was Lil Ray. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Shit. It is what it is. It is look, what it is. Like, what I got to say about that is... It is what it is. Like... <laughs> oh. That's all you got to say. Like, yeah, for sure. Like, okay, well, move on to the next piece, you know. Heard you've been tagging some dishes. Dish F. Eh. This is back and forth with L5. What was that? L5. Who are you dissing? What is it? There's some young nigga out here. Oh, yeah. The bro. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. That <laughs> shit right there. Yeah. That shit. That shit. That shit just got down. That's just a video game shit, though. We just be. Video game shit? Yeah, that's just game. video game shit. They like be on some playing shit, on some GTA like, shit. Just, like we just be playing on on games. Oh, that's that's what that shit is. That shit, that what they did. That ain't that. Things they be playing. And yeah. Oh, like I don't even know him like that. They be on some video game shit. Ain't nothing like serious. That not serious. serious. That nobody got to be worried or nothing about. Nothing like that. No, no caution tape it shit like that. Just come with the game. Just come. Yeah, it's just like some look at it. I was gonna engage a little something. You know, you done had plays and games or something. You know, you got to sometimes. It was like, games, right? spice it up. It's a little boring. I ain't that. You know, it's just a little something. Oh, but I don't got no no beef as far as in, as in I want to hurt somebody. I don't want to hurt nobody. So now your song I, I love me. Nobody. You're just saying this stuff. Yeah, you know. Oh, what is it? Oh, what's that? Ooh. I got, I just got to say I ain't got no saying, fuck that saying, you don't even want to hear any rip for that. I'm just, I'm just pretty like, the birth year, how you feel, and whoever he be talking about, shit, I hope they got them, stay out of the way, because if he really serious about what he be talking about, then, shit, they, them folk, them folk probably be gone soon, but if they don't, then shit, this shit probably be fake. This shit probably be fake as hell. All right, so what the fuck is 76? What the fuck? So bad. What is that? Oh, is 76? We got the, we got the, we got the question. We got the answers. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? Yeah, that's you know the um, uh, what's the name? The I'm gonna take basketball you team. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> you know about that? Yeah, man, it, man, man, this nigga over here, man, we playing the game. Man, this nigga just keep team with these folk, bro. He just keep team with. I'm the just sad. Oh my man, god. Hey, yeah, bro. I hate no folk, man. No folk. That nigga gotta be team. Man, that shit be blowing me. So I got down, made a song in the house one day. Hey, yeah. 
we we playing the game downstairs to but the studio upstairs. So I go upstairs and make a song about this shit. Yeah. This shit, that'd be crazy. I be just making little shit like that. Nick don't need to be knowing. They went viral. Mm. Just mm, try to. What do you think is one of your underrated songs that should be more viral now? I have an opinion. What? Clap, clap, boom. I like that. That shit was hard. This is a lot wrong about that. That was super hard. And All right, that's fine. I think those two are really fine. I, I think they're hard too. I think mean, those two are like really underrated. Those that's my opinion. But I mean you recorded other shit, so like uh, or I heard the leak of Michael Jackson, so it's that like, shit ain't man. I was like, they did one on some like five minute little five six shit. That was a little strange. That shit will record a riff. I, I, I did went ran through that riff and oh uh, damn what's the bad song? I got this, I don't even remember the name of that bit. No. I did a bit. I don't remember the name, but I can find this shit on my phone. I'll probably find it one day. Okay. I don't remember the name, but, but I never did. I did a trip to that bit, but I took that bit down because my little sister was in that bit. And that shit slow. Mm. Yeah, I took that motherfucker down. Took the trip down, and I never put that bit back up. But people probably know that song. It was in, I had a blue, the blue LED lights in the background. I said, right there, running right back. Well, I forgot the song, but yeah, I know it. I know it's song. Okay. You were shooting somewhere at a church for what snippet? Nah, that, that just, uh, that just a filter right now. You were just like, it was a filter? Yeah, yeah, it's, at it's, a church. yeah it's a filter right now. You ain't shooting at an actual. Uh, it's, it's, you just didn't want to disrespect or like what? It was just funny. Uh, like you didn't want to go to the actual church. I mean, hey, I mean, fuck it. The technology we got now, you know, like technology. Yeah, this shit, this technology shit, crazy. Like, Might as well, yeah. This shit looks so damn real, don't you it? Pretend like you're in a mansion. Hey, yeah, yeah. You can pretend like you're underwater. You can pretend like you're anywhere. Nah, you can be at President Obama's house, like. This nigga, this nigga <laughs> called me the other day. I'm thinking that nigga flying, but he not. <laughs> yeah, yeah, shit crazy with technology do done. They just do something so funny. Oh my goodness. Oh god. So you also did just did the video shoot for Let's Play a Game. Yeah. So how was that? What was the inspiration behind the video? You t- you tell me what you think of it first. Then I'm tell you. Okay, so Pause. Well, we taping this. We won't see it yet. But we'll see it until afterwards. So it's a game about it. I like, made that song on Halloween. Okay. I forgot to tell you that too. Okay. I made that motherfucker for Halloween. It was really supposed to be a Halloween video shoot. I was supposed to shoot that song on Halloween. That's why I really get you know fuck about that song. Kyle supposed to shot that bit on Halloween, but uh, that shit. That's what it was. So, so that song was just like, I also said, like, damn, I might wear that shit. Really so, I got so much most music, like, that, that song ain't gonna lie, I don't really got no thoughts about that. Because I got, like, as I as I go, I start listening to that shit. Like, you know how in your notes, you got music in your notes? Yeah. You know how when you press it, like, that shit will show you what music you listen to. Like, if the music you listen to, more gonna be at the top. I'm like, oh shit, bottom. Like, this is, I like this another phone call. Like, my other phone broke. But, I don't listen, as I go, as I make song, like my newest song, that's the shit I listen to. Like, Stitch. I don't really pay that. Y'all can't get that. Y'all ain't got that. Oh. Um, yeah, see, that's Stitch. coming up. Stitch ain't got down. Is that something you just recorded? Stitch, yeah. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> them two those are the songs I listen to most because those are my most recent songs all my old shit I don't listen to it as I go on I just feel like all my new song newest song be better no, I just stop listening to that shit the real song's already out yeah, yeah not till that time not <laughs> not, not, not know, released by me though they might be out yeah not released by me though but they out they not they not might be out they out for sure Oh, over that for sure where the I probably, yeah. 
Are these people? I, does that sound hard? You and the boy, nigga, we, we walking. Me and him walking to some apartment to go do to just go go out something. Yeah, seeing somebody pull in front of us, they playing our song. And they ain't even stop and say, what's up? So I know there ain't no way. They're like, damn, how the hell you get that? I'm for right back. He tell me, they listen to our shit. I'm like, nigga, they listening to our shit. Dumb ass, how the hell they get it? They just be like, from that point, I just knew it was like, no good. Yeah, I really love this shit, but no. I don't even put this shit on my phone, so I know for a fact on, on Earth nobody could get it. This shit going to be hard drive. Computer. Computer. You're going to lock it down and then yeah. when you need to. Fried. Okay. Over it. I really shit over it. So when you drop in something new, when we, when can people expect to... Yeah, a couple days. A couple days? A couple days. Real soon. Mm-hmm. Looking out for it? Hey, yeah, me and Latina got shit Little going on. Fun. The take going on. Little mixtape. Yeah, uh, couple videos, visuals. Ooh. A lot of visuals. Visuals. Yeah, yeah. And take, a fire take, I'm going to see. And hot shit. I'm ready. Oh, my God. Yeah, yeah. We're getting lit. Okay, it's almost 2024, you know. It's 2024, so what do you want to accomplish by the end of 2024? I need to have... Oh, shit, you see about the answer or something? Yeah, like, you know, wildest dreams. You got a year. 365 days, it's just grind. A Do year? You, know you need, yeah. Two. I better be a damn that B. I'll be paying all these need. Everybody. All the, all my bro on me and beans. Like, that's going to be our medium. Reviews. Like, you know how you might, somebody might drop a song and not everybody like it, but they got a, they got a guaranteed fan base. They know finna go watch that motherfucker. So out of, out of all these hundred million people that just watched your last video, probably not going to watch your next video, but a million of them folks going to watch that bit. So for us, our shit going to be a bean. That shit, you get a little means, we get a little beans and we Make that hot shit. I shit do hundreds of beans. I don't even know what come after that, but that's what we go do. Trillion. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, yep, trillion. Oh, and what come after that? I don't know. Ultra millions? I don't know. That's what I'm saying. See, I'm trying to get past yeah, all that trillion yeah. shit. It's, we're going to be on some shit. Be up, up. Yeah. Up to the I want my number. I want to have a new word on YouTube. My shit better have a new, like for the views. Man, my shit gonna have a new label next to it. Like, for as far as views, I'm gonna make them update the views. My shit gonna be changing in real time. That's how my shit, that's how my shit gonna be going on. What you gonna do? Drop like every day, every other day? Crazy. I, you know, I know I only gotta drop every day, but I, I can if I want to. Or flood the market with like a whole, like, ooh, five visuals. Bam. What we gonna do, you know? I be just sound Instagram. like they sound like what's in my head. That's what Beyonce did. Lemonade. Dropped off. I ain't Beyonce. I mean, hey, let me. I'm what? bad kid. Uh, exactly. Don't get confused. Don't so look, I see. Over the course of a month, I'm trying to get at least twenty visuals, fifteen at least. Mm. At at the I I ain't gonna say twenty. I say fifteen. But anything else you want to tell the people, let them know why we still here. We in Atlanta, Fly House Atlanta. What you want to tell the people? I want to tell them. Be safe. A nigga like this. A nigga like this. Like right here. We look like this. Because in the city, again, this is it's an interview. Hey, you nigga, I better be safe. I didn't rap shit with y'all be trying. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I'm mean, cool. Hey, you nigga, I better stay safe, though. Yeah. Say to be safe. Just be safe. To be safe. Do you be safe? You gonna take your own advice? You be safe? Yeah, nah. I'm dangerous. You dangerous? Why you gonna be dangerous? Okay. Is how the life supposed to be, right? And you and you think about life in the opposite. 
I'm good. Yeah. So that means good shit to be bad shit. Bad shit to be good shit. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Right. Well, mind fuck. Yup. That's how we run that. <laughs> so, and that's just how you gotta live it. So. And, and anybody who wanna give me a spider implant, you know what that is? A what implant? Spider implant, my hand. What's wrong with your hand? Man, I want the spider shit in my hand. You know, the, the spider web being your... You want to be Spider-Man? What? Fuck you, what do you mean a spider implant? Like, oh my God. <laughs> a spider implant. In your hand. Just lick it up. You, you, don't, know. you don't know. What's that, dude? Like, is your hand fucked up? Hell no. Nah, never mind. <laughs> I'm thinking about spider Implant. Man. Spider implant. It's a, it's a spider poking out your hand. You know how hand look regular? It's a spider... Oh. The cosmetics. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry that uh, the rest of us watch Marvel. So anybody else you talk to. Spider like, implant. Oh my God. You're going to be Spider. You know how you got it got now. That's like that little Uzi shit where you put the dot on it. Nobody else thinks about that. Yeah, like, you want a spider implant. I want a spider I implant. the general population is going to know what a spider implant is. Okay. That's cute. But you can That's cute. That's cute. It is cute. That's cool uh-huh. though, actually. Like, this shit going to be a home. Nah, you wanna see? I do. But it's not like it's gonna hurt. I'm scared. <laughs> I'm scared for you. I actually don't wanna be Spider Man. I would. Nah, fuck Spider Man. That nigga a superhero. You don't wanna he be a superhero. superhero. You wanna be a villain? Oh, well, I guess you're uh, technically for us, a uh, villain. Considering what you say. Yeah, my bad. I forgot. Of course you don't wanna be a hero. Of course you don't wanna be Spider Man. Yeah, uh, for Spider Man. Look, this this is uh, spider implant. You know what your hand look like? Is that a real spider? Uh, so them. Oh my god! Well, they're gonna pull it up and put it in here because oh my god, that is crazy. Everyone Google spider. They get it to like next year. I'm having them. That is so. And fun. if I like it, I'm get to. That's from this out. What the fuck? You know what? They call me a punk. That, yeah, no punk culture like rock like punk. But yeah, so I see that you'd rather be a villain. Do you have any villains that you look at for inspiration or anything oh, yeah. that you favor? Yeah, damn. But I would just thank you, buddy. Zay, he can't come to my head. He rip shit, rip your face off, eat shit. Mm-hmm. But it ain't really no villain. It's the shit from the movie, and that motherfucker so fire. And that bitch don't got no mouth. That bitch don't even got no face. It just got like tentacles as a mouth. It just reach out, bite your face off, rip shit, eat your ass. That's not too weird. Oh my god. It's the, yeah, I think I know exactly what you're talking about. Jesus Christ. I think that motherfucker gonna, um, um, I don't know what this shit called, what the hell name of the net for this shit. I was watching that shit, God. Hey yeah, Strange Strange Strange. Strange. Hey, yeah, that shit went, went rip out like that without the T fat on the thing. Yeah, hey, yeah, that shit too so that shit too far. I got I gotta get that I'm gonna get a Scratch thing video thing too. Okay, Scratch thing had too much shit going on. Me getting that shit on real out nigga popping out the wall. Auntie tripping. He and the bird seeing shit, he ripping out the wall, nigga stuck it behind the wall and shit. I can see the inspiration in that, like 100%. The yeah. way you're describing Stranger Things is exactly how you talk on your song, just like very graphic. You be going to them little things what you walk around with them weird that costumes and shit. What are you talking about? What things? Um, convention? Yeah, yeah. Yes. You go to the old, um, where the hell you be dressed up at? I'm a cosplayer. I told you I like anime and stuff. What the fuck is that? Um, what, so what, what, what character do you be? Let me see. Yurichi, um, from Bleach. Oh, Richie for what? From Bleach. Bleach? Yeah, it's on him. You wouldn't even know if I showed you silly dude. Oh, you talking about that light-skinned nigga who be, oh, he got a little temp for age and shit? <laughs> That's Boondogs. Nah, hell nah. It's not. I know what the fuck Boondogs is. I'm black. A oh, no, I'm talking about Bleach. Didn't he, he skinny? He a man. Right. Well, he got orange hair. Each ago. Yeah, I think I seen this shit for I got some weird ass kids be 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 playing and watching that shit. 
I don't like that shit though. No. I'm the man. That shit okay. weird. You're sitting here talking about you like horror and stuff that like like. But that shit things, weird. And you like stuff that like rips and tears apart. You need to watch Attack on Titan. And he watches sure. anime. Anime, he just. I don't be watching movies and TV and shit like that. Tell them that he needs to get the inspiration from Attack on Titan. You like all that horror and horror and nastiness, you'll get it from there. And it's animated, so they can take it further. Yeah. To watch it. And I'm telling you, people, the anime watchers, I'm gonna bring them. And they're gonna be like, yeah. At, they're gonna at you the whole time on Instagram, like, yes, you yeah. should watch it. You should watch oh, it. Oh, anime, that shit weird here, cause I. It be I I had it one anime nigga in my club, bro. His ass used to show my words. I used to stay fighting. Like, I used to fight his ass like two times every like every week. You have to fight him. His ass, cause he just used to stay doing weird. It just like he always did be doing a little weird ass shit. That shit be like, that. He just and then he be that. I don't even want to talk about this shit, but that anime shit here. Then nigga be thinking that they somewhere they ain't not got their like, arm behind their back running this shit. True. Everybody I don't be fake with that shit. Twice. I don't be fake with that shit. That shit be throwing me out. That shit, they're like, man, they won't even say nothing to you. You might just throw your headphones on. Keep walking like a nigga. That's your ass doing all that okay, shit. Okay, so you really don't like the nerds. You got like... like it ain't even like, about that. It's just like, they be true. Well, okay, not all the nerds are like that. But I don't be saying that to nerd. Like, I ain't no lame man. He like, nerd can't we fight live. back. We live. Nerd for Raggy, you feel some some nerd some nerds gonna be fought though. Oh god, I seen nerd I seen nerd beat the shit out of nigga ass so you are. Oh yeah, they get they get lit. Yeah. They got the power of God yeah, and yeah. anime on their side. Like what the fuck? They yeah, they be saying shit shit like that. I know it's a meme. I saw Let me see that let me see that ear. Is it like it was like No, that's not nice. <laughs> I am a fairy. I'm a succubus, so of course I have white oh, hair. Oh, what? <laughs> succubus. All right. Anyway. I know we're not talking about monsters, because if anybody's the monster, it's you. What you did bad to somebody before? You was not going to turn my interview into um, talking to me. Yeah, answer the question, though, gang. What's the bad? What, what's some bad shit you did to somebody before? Okay, I be trying to make it seem like Nick be doing so much bad shit like y'all ain't did. She me all like what you bad. Sometimes you can't say that stuff because it'll make you wow. intimidating. But you just add me some. And I just told you. See, bestie, I had an illegal pass, so we can't say that. Mm. Uh, all right. That was illegal, too, okay? You're 17, I'm 22. I best believe. Don't all right, come on. Period. Anywhere. You need to tell these people, what's up? Like, what is something that you have for the younger generation coming up? I mean, you're technically the younger generation, but people that want to be like you. Like, you know, don't. So you know, be yourself. For it, like, be yourself. Be yourself. I want to be like myself. <laughs> I, I fuck up trying to be like nothing. Yeah. Trying to be like somebody else. You, when you try to be like somebody else, it always gonna show because you trying so hard, and it gonna sound, it gonna show like you trying, you can't do that. You just gotta be yourself for this shit. Everybody, you gotta do that right shit, bro. Rap, rap name for everybody. For sure. I mean, but anyone in Atlanta pretty much raps. Yeah, that shit right there, hell no. That's another thing. Yeah, that. Yeah, you see that down. That shit. You don't think everyone should be rapping? I mean, do what you do. Do what you please. It's just like, fuck that shit. Do what you please. Like, yeah, you want to rap, just rap. Fuck it. Fuck it. Might as well. Fuck it, bro. Where can these people follow you at? You know, let them know. My Instagram, baby kid. My, I don't know where anything is here. I just be on Instagram. But my Instagram, baby kid. No capital, letter, none of that. Do you want to shout out your homeboys? Pass the mic. What you want to do? You want to shout them out? Go right here. Nigga, know what the fuck going on? All out of the fair, but shit. Nigga, follow me at whole lot too. Yeah. Yo, follow me at Day One Willie. <laughs> Day One Willie. You know what's up. Anyway, okay. Whoa. And y'all already know you. At Cyrus Becky, you know, I'm the coolest monster you ever knew. Brr. And you can go ahead and follow us at flophouse.atl, all platforms, flophouse in there, YouTube. Uh, blah, 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 blah. You know, oh, didn't you get a shirt? Speaking of our website, oh, hey, yeah. Merch, 
What shirt did you get for the merch? I heart grown hoes. Mm-hmm. That was our Lost City collab. Um, yeah. I like grown hoes. Grown hoes like me too. You like grown hoes. Something about these uh, young niggas. I'm grown. Course, they love grown hoes. I'm young nigga though. I'm grown though. He's grown. They all love grown hoes. So, cop yourself a cool ass shirt if you love grown hoes. Just like my boy. Just like all these niggas. Go ahead and cop it. So, you know. Oh, we so, got We out here. And that's her in. Yeah. Go ahead and throw your...